Disaster, disaster, disaster. Hello, welcome back. Yeah, uh, so tonight, plans have changed several times. I was actually planning on going up to the Longmind, up high, in a tent or a bivy bag, and uh, somewhere with a nice view. However, nature has different ideas. So, uh, yeah, been at work all day. It's been, it's been nice, it's been lovely. However, as soon as I finish work, and all the way until tomorrow, it's due 90% chance of rain. So, however, <laughs> I'm pretty sure I said that last week, in last week's video, and it didn't actually rain. Whereas this week, it's actually raining. So, we're going for a van camp instead. Uh, again, I was going to go up Longmond, and then I thought, it's a long way to go, just to sit in a van in the rain. So, I got on park for night. I was going to go dogging, to be honest. I mean, like I say, the plans have changed loads of times. I was going to go on park for night, find somewhere where all the doggers go, because those videos do really well. And then I just, so, we're going to a place called Ironbridge. Right, so, I can confirm we have pulled into the car park and Definitely 10 a.m. till 5 p.m. every day, including bank holidays. So let's have a little look. There's already a motor in down here, so I'm kind of assuming. I'm kind of assuming it would be alright here. Oh, saying that, that's private. Someone's house? Whoa, sit down. I think I'm happy there. Private car park. Anyway, let's get inside. So, not joking, yeah? I will give a bit of a tour around if the rain dies off. But for now, I'm just going to bunker down, to be honest. Um, Oh, I've had to buy some super glue on the way here because like I say I've come from work tonight go straight back to work in the morning and the soles of my shoes whilst I was at work come out so I feel like a right peasant but they're not even that old this is what I didn't you know so I've got to super glue them tonight hopefully they'll last me for tomorrow when I'm at work yeah check that out Hopefully I can do this without gluing my fingers together. Don't really want this in here, so I'm gonna put it at the back. So, I've even brought with me my electric scooter. Because I thought be able to go and have a little ride somewhere. I ain't getting out in this weather. Yes, I know, it's only a Wednesday night. Is it Wednesday? Yeah. But, who cares? Cheers. Right then, so, on the menu tonight is chicken tikka breast steaks. I'm having them in a wrap. And then some caramelized cheesecake, well, Biscoff cheesecake in it, basically. 
Oh, disaster, disaster, disaster. Right, not only have I forgot my toilet, I've also, so I, I use these basically. And just chuck all my stuff in one of them. Well, no, tell a lie, chuck all my stuff in a couple of them. So when I'm in the van, I just get back to the garage, chuck them in. However, what I have not realised is I've only picked the one up and the other one's got cutlery and everything else in. So the only bit of cutlery I've got is some scissors. So I'm just gonna go with it. Nothing else I can do. I'm, yeah, I'm hungry. I'm just gonna make it work. Oh, that's better. We're saying, could have done with a bit of cheese. A little bit dry. Anyway, cheers. Sorted. The goods have been purchased. Two pound plus however much in fuel it's cost me to get there. It's only 10 minutes down the road. So anyway, um, let's get back to the park up and um, yeah. But in the meantime, anyway, <laughs> you know when there's a town and it's like, it's got a literal meaning of the town. That makes sense. So the town I'm stopping at is called Ironbridge and there's an actual iron bridge which goes across the river. Um, and that's got me thinking though, was the town named before the bridge or was the bridge there before they named the town? Is that the same thing? Anyway, yeah, let me know your thoughts if you know what I'm trying to say. Uh, let me know your thoughts if you don't know what I'm trying to say. Do you know what I mean? I'm not sure, I'll be honest, I'm not even sure if this video is going to go out. If you are watching this video, um, it's probably because on the week it's gone out, I had a busy week and couldn't get a video done. So this is more like a stop filler as such, purely because oh, it's just me and the man, isn't it, really? Weather's awful. Yeah. However, what I have come to realise is Iron Bridge is a really nice place. So if you are local, I suggest you come and visit. And uh, oh, I mean, that park up. As long as I have no problems, it's quite in the middle of nowhere. Why in the middle of nowhere? That doesn't make sense either. It's quite well, you know, it's just across the river from the town, but it's actually quite well hidden as such. Um, so yeah, I'll definitely be making a return with uh, with Kate and the kids. Maybe just Kate. And this is pretty cool as well. So I'm not stopping here. To be honest, I'm not even sure what it is, but it's a bit of a museum piece. In fact, it is undercover, so I might get out and have a little look. And let's do just that. Get out a quick look before we retreat to the car park for the goods. Retrieve to the car park? Why would you retrieve to a car park? I get my torch. Hang on a minute. Oh, look at this. Wait to see this. I knew there was a reason to put this bad boy in. Wait till you see this. Absolute beast. I'm guessing. I guess there's some stairs there, and it looks like you can actually go to the top and have a little look. 
I ain't doing that tonight though with it being so wet and dirty and muddy and horrible. So yeah, there you go. I definitely want to come back to. It's pretty cool. Poor. Not gonna lie. I've been waiting for this. Oh no. Oh, there's a freaking hair on it. Oh God. Oh, it's put me right off. There's a hair on it. Anyway, cheers. Oh, that spoon's awful. If you've got Aldi near you, and you like Biscoff, you get yourself to Aldi some of these. Oh my God, it's so good. But look at that spoon. It's just, just bending. I wonder if I'm take them back. <laughs> I'm only joking. Anyway. Oh, sugar. I'm going to enjoy this. All right, both of these. Just chill out. Cheers. Hmm. Well, that's a bit too hot. So... Why don't I give you the whistle stop tour where we were last night? Yes, umbrella is required. So I'm not too sure what I did show you last night, but I mean, that's the exit road, or well, the entrance road, so we're going out there in a minute. We do come also in there, come along this road, and just along there, there's a pub. Batch is going to die in a minute, so if it goes off then, see you next week. Anyway, there wants to be a private, a bit private uh, parking, which I don't really understand because I don't know where the house is. I need a drone, don't I? This is the part of the pub car park. There's the pub. And there's a few houses up there. And there's also a couple more bits of private parking. So you must have allocated parking here. I can hear someone. Hey up. Ah, there you go then. Residence houses down there. I assume this is their parking. What a what a what a quirky place. What a quirky car park. Yeah, as you see there's a few cars still left in the car park. Assuming they probably went to the pub last night. And then to come in down there and you can walk across the bridge into Iron Bridge. Unfortunately, I've got to go to work, so that's not happening today. And obviously we couldn't do it last night because of the rain. So uh, like I said before, if you are here watching this one, then it's because it's a bit of a stop video. As I had nothing else really for this week. Um, so yeah, please don't unsubscribe. Please subscribe if you're not already. Uh, like the video, do me a favour, and uh, yeah, I'll see you next week. Thanks very much. So basically, we've just come to the other side. This is the actual Lion Bridge, as you can see. And I think, oh, in fact, yes, I can just about see the top of the caravan that was there. So I was parked just up there. So those how, those car park spaces must feed these houses down here. And is that, that must be the pub. But yeah. So had it not been raining last night, I'd have had to come across the bridge. I've got a look around the town. But I have been here before in the day when it's been like heavy rain and the whole town's flooded all down there. It's all flooded. So it's uh Yeah, worrying times for people when it happens. But yeah, we were just up there last night. So yeah. Anyway, thought I'd show you that before we go to work. Drop people.